What it is, what's up? New socks in the cut. First off, Uniqlo, fantastic fucking socks. I've had some shit from theirs. This isn't sponsored, it's just if you want some good shit, uh, simple shit, stated shit, but good shit, um, I recommend going to them. Uh, secondly, I watched a fucking movie without being too on my phone. No fucking Subway Surfers, no other fucking YouTube video playing in the middle of the damn movie. So, I feel like I'm mentally woke right now, and I'm ready to put my whole dick in pause. Uh, in this, in this chapter. <laughs> Just go full three inches in this fucking chapter. That's the energy we're coming with this. Anyway, last time we seen it, uh, basically, Kawaki, not Kawaki, Himawari, uh, the other Uzumaki, the one people haven't talked about in a hundred chapters. Um, other than Damon trying to spit game to her, and Slash being afraid of her power, uh, slash. Other than that moment, we haven't talked about it in a hundred chapters. So, basically, uh, our guy, leader, Juby thing, was like, holy shit, I thought it was Naruto Uzumaki. Instead, it's Himori who has the, the two uh, whiskers instead of three that Naruto has. I want to say, there's nothing that can make Inochi like. Like, you know she has the same gut that I do. And I think that just you just can't get past that. Uh, but the fits here, very valid. Uh, I don't, this is probably Ikimoto, more so. I mean, Kishimoto may have had some con contribution to this, but pretty much Ikimoto. Ikimoto, you did your damn job. Uh, these fits are hard. I think Naruto and Bleach have always had just incredible fits, even with them in their waning years, uh, manga-wise. They've always had great fits. Nine tells is the name of the chapter. Let's get into it. Uh, we are still recording. Hopefully, that does not fuck up. So this is uh, Shika. You know, Shiko Cho, the I guess third generation. I, I feel like that cell has been together for forever, based on their lore. I don't remember it all from uh, OG Naruto. We thought we were chasing Uzumaki Naruto, so I'm not surprised we fought this little girl instead. Sensory unit. So it's Shikamaru. Uh, Shika die. What was Shikamaru's dad name? Was it just... Oof. It was Shika something. I do know that. Uh, he can feel... Yeah, I think he can feel like the trans... The conversation is happening. Transmission is what I meant to say. Um, we've run into two likely trespassers. No sign of Master Sasuke. We request immediate backup. Why come to such a remote place? You're looking for something... Uh, likely, Shika would be like the brains of this, like his father in the years past. Um, Nara Shika dies. So that book is like an encyclopedia, I guess, on the ninja of Konoha. Of Kazuma Suri Moegi's team. Oh, so, that, so the one that they took, Moegi, the little like bunny thing, the other tail beast demon is the what what is it uh Jonin the Jonin of their cell okay current Hokage son I have a message from my dad I'm trying to look for Naruto I give a fuck about Shikamaru uh three years ago yeah I just seen me anywhere in this village for the only nine tail signatures come from this girl she as I had said, I may, I don't want to edit too much because I want to get this out quickly as so I can get on to the next chapter, which came out a couple days ago. But I believe I said at some point in the previous one that more than likely, uh, with being born from a living Jinchuriki, uh, maybe he, some, um, some Juby, or not Juby, but Jinchuriki residue, uh, in. Hinata's, I know it's Hinata, but Hinata's uh, egg. I'm Jeff Goldblum in this right now, but basically, the imagine like his sperm cells have like chakra tails, like one tail Naruto from OG Naruto. Imagine that cloak, but like on his sperm cells. So like when he does his do. Anyway, um, what's he going on about? Plus, looking at him, he's gonna be a total baddie. I wish I had a total baddie right now. Uh, explain yourself. What's nine times I do with Himawari? And, uh, 
the philosopher that OG Toby's demon is. I like this panel for some reason. I'm gonna, it's gonna be a potential thumbnail here. So, yet I like that. Then he pretty much sneaks up and tries to grab Himawari. Uh, it's a chakra tree. And things that caught Moegi and the like. So he'd have another Denchuriki in his possession. He doesn't have one right now. I kind of misremembered what Naruto is. So his shadow possession can stop. I mean, effectively, like, that that thing, that contraption is like an extension of his hand or whatever. Typically speaking, his hand, his feet, something, you know. Uh, so that's, that's why that works. It's not a, like if it captures you, you just instantly done type of thing. A single verbal exchange. I will say I always thought that Inoshika Cho was like the most locked in of the OG cells. Our sole target today is Uzumaki Himawari. We bear no enmity in some of those words enmity towards team 10 however if you insist on continuing to resist we'll have no choice but to attack you I wonder if she's going to go into uh, Kiyubi Chakra mode I don't know if she could do that just instinctually I wonder if he has like omnipotence can he feel this shit like can he feel being like attacked or not even attacked but just like seen because this glare like there's nothing I would imagine that just from being, I don't know why it does this, but just being stared at by Himawari, I don't think he'd give off that type of, like, kind of leer, you know? I've been playing Pokemon Sun recently, and leer has just been in the back of my head. It's a fucking useless move. Uh, I think it's Karma's going off. I think that's what's happening right now. Is he me actually flying or just... What's, what's Clash and Koji? Is he just, like, Intel? Is he not just going to help and fight at all? Shikadai is kind of playing just like how Shikamaru would, kind of trying to gain Intel without really oppressing or making a press you know even warning you know she could show yo i forgot the damn uh how you big stepping with size seven mans on size seven shoes on i think that's what this is what Ken, uh, drake says about kendrick don't look back is this from bart uh their current location is sector d northwest their team 10 has engaged Behind Yoshikamaru, link up with Yam Yamanaka Ino, Barto's enter Konoha. Okay, so Barto's gonna get locked back in with Ino and Shikamaru, I assume. How could I face Ida if you died? I don't remember what fucked up Karma or Karma Kawaki. It was actually last because he tried to step in on um, the Juby. Uh, demons and he got his ass kicked. That's what happened. It's because you have near limitless regenerative ability doesn't mean you should be reckless. I wonder if that's because of the like construction he has from uh, Amado or if it's because of the uh, karma. I don't know. I'm assuming it's the former, but so we're gonna see Barto against uh, Kawaki here. Mokutan Jutsu Jutsu. So that's so that's not an extension of like their bodies, which Kawaki does something similar with his, you know, his arm can like shoot off into tendrils like that. That's wood release. So it's like you know what Obito did when he was in the cloak, uh, the Zetsu cloak. Uh it's like what, you know, everybody used wood release did it. I always thought that was like tendrils, you know, like part of their body. Under Pride One, you know, just like before, there are two enemies who are divine trees by the look of it. They supposedly came looking for Naruto, but now they're after Himawari. Now, Baruto does have the same whiskers that Himawari does. I guess my theory about like that being relevant is kind of uh, moot, I guess. Kawaki's found me. Did he not, like, I guess, but no, Kawaki and Baruto can't hide their chakra signatures from each other, they can sense each other. Regardless, because of the karma. So I guess he just wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Are you mocking me? Varto is confident he clears Kawaki. I, I've gotten that vibe since the beginning of this part. You're the enemy of Konoha. What? The, why is he still so obsessed with this? Like to the degree, like he thinks, like, oh, if I kill him, then you know Naruto is. But like, I don't, I don't get the point of this. Yeah, 
I guess he can't bring Naruto back until Boruto's dead. Like, I think that's pretty much the goal he said at the end of part one. I mean, it's supposed to be like damn instantaneous, that ability of his, or the ability of uh, Ishiki's. It's supposed to be pretty much instantly. And he reacted to what was effectively like instant appearances, I guess. See, this is what I was talking about. Like, I thought, but that's not what released, really, because he's been doing it from the jump, and he didn't even know how to like do chakra. Unless you're telling me like his body's based off of what release, but anyway, that's why I was confused. Cause it looks just like how you would just, like look at the divine trees and kind of see how they. But yeah, he's just like speed blessing him. Like he's, I, I said it in one of the first videos I did for this part, but like Baruto is clearly like the top dog amongst the ninja at this point. Like the only ones above him clearly like the divine trees. And really, from what I can tell, at least. How much did you train? <laughs> Delta's been like good like humor so far in this uh since she's gotten kind of domesticated. Cause I mean we know that like uh Kawaki has a fake karma that was implanted by Amato, kind of like a goal line defense type of thing. But Boruto is still a, a real one that contains Momoshiki. So he hasn't perfected karma. He really hasn't had a chance to train it, because I mean I don't know who would have be able to train him in karma, you know. That pretty much gives Kawaki like the only real advantage that anybody would have over Boruto. I wonder if he could just like absorb Shadow. Is that Tail Beast? Uh, not Tail Beast. Tail Beast Ball. Oh, he can just do a Tail Beast Ball with his eye. He doesn't even need his mouth or anything like that. His hands, anything. He just can. God damn. This dude is like. Insane. Shit. And he like loaded that up. He loaded that up after like what? Probably like three or four seconds, and then he just threw it out. That wasn't like a focused tail beast ball. Shit, dude. Yeah, he's he he. I don't know about all of them. I assume like their power is somewhat relative to who they were before they got captured. I don't know why I assume that, but I would just think that like Sasuke to be number two behind this guy right here, but they definitely appear to be just narratively very, very powerful. So you gotta understand, like, these guys were not sentient beings previous to cold fucking up. Like, they were just ruthless beasts, pretty much. So there's, like, legit, intel or legit interest from the Divine Tree's perspective to, like, actually seek out, like, human instincts and human traits. That's why, like, they're actually, like, philosophizing all these different parts of the fight. They probably wouldn't unleash that attack again. Let's see what they'll do. I, I'm just betting next page. He's going to, like, appear, like, right in front of them. Like, literally right in front of them. It's just a guess. Okay. Oh, my God. I, I, I saw... I try to always, like, look at the right side first. It's the first page and then get to the second. But I just sneak the peek on the first... The other side, the second page. Oh, my God. That's so nostalgic. Um, either way, shouldn't we fly the village? Good thinking. We can lead them away, and then I'll escape on my own. What are you talking about? It's the same for you. They're too strong at this rate of all. Oh, my God. Himawari. It's a baby QB. Whoa. I came with that jerk ten tails to sniff me out. You know who I am. And yo, come on. We knew we knew there was no way that he was gonna be cooked. Like I I I'm not saying anything new here. Everybody and their mama knew Sasuke is gonna get his other eye at some point. Naruto is gonna get Kurma again. Now in what capacity, I don't know. Because like even if they got back to those points, like if Naruto, what we last saw, got Kuruma again. Baryon most only way he could even compete against guys who... I'm going to just... just The way Shonen work, I would just bet money that Ishiki at that point in time was probably weaker than what we're going to see by the time like, Naruto escapes out of his entrapment. Just the way Shonen works. You kind of build up on the villain. So whether it's this guy, the lead divine tree, or whoever, probably going to be stronger than Ishiki was when Boruto 
or Naruto just barrio mode. And that was also on an Ishiki that's on his last leg at that point. Um Sasuke, I don't know how to get Rinning on. Or, or he may just get double shiny on, but I don't know how to do that. But either way, they both are not like the what what's the term? Bellwethers? They're not the ones who are gonna like bring Konoha back over the top. They may help develop Baruto, Himawari, um, what's her name? Sarada. Get them right, but Sarada at this point, man. If Himawari has nine tails assets, which one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, um she might be like legitimately like it's crazy, but she might be like top five, top ten in this I mean like it's baby Kurama, so you know, but it matters. I mean, I think it's important. Only thing to keep in mind, though, is that everybody could be in a capacity to really train her. But just mastering... I mean, Naruto had to train to master KCM. A little, you know? Like, he got KCM one when he subjugated Korama. Like, when he beat him in Sage Mode. He got KCM two when, like, Kurama like, kind of agreed to help him. But he still had to kind of train, I feel like, to, like, really... And he did, like, the whole, like... He was in the... Under the springs. He was, like, learning, like, nature and shit like that. I don't know. I, I think it's going to be some training involved. But, realistically, like, I don't know if Naruto ever really trained with Kurama, per se, to, like, become better at using KCO. I think he just kind of, like, gained access to it. So maybe if she could get Kurama back to his full state, be, be the Raikage, the former one, I may have some knowledge on how to train. So there's like a few people that'd be able to help her. Gara is still Kazakage at this point in time. As far as in Konoha, I think Kakashi is all about retired. I mean, Kakashi's like, like, I don't think he's ever appeared in the manga like any kind of real sense. I think early on, the same way like Guy was like, hey, I'm Guy. I think Kakashi may appear early on, but I don't think they've really ever done anything in the manga. Um, but he should still be alive. So maybe Kakashi, but clearly like Kakashi's in fighting shape. He won't be like doing physical training, but like just like, hey, here's like Naruto kind of got, you know, around using Kurama. But a lot of barriers that Naruto had in training his chakra to mesh with, you know, Kurama's chakra was because Kurama was resistant to Naruto. That same barrier isn't here. So I'm just basically trying to project how strong Himawari would be. I would imagine, like, pretty powerful. At least, like, stronger than most of the beginning and tuning to this point. Maybe stronger than Sarada, maybe. But she's like a pretty adept three to mo Sharingan user, right? No, she. I think she gained Mangekyo when Naruto or Baruto, like, at the end of Baruto, basically, when she last talked to Sasuke. I think she gained Mangekyo, if I remember correctly. So maybe Sarada? If she has Mangekyo, she can suppress Koruma, so. I don't know. But, um, yeah. It's going pretty good. Now, I can go ahead and do the next video, which I, I may go ahead and do it. I don't know. What time is it? 11.15. We got this one done pretty quickly. It's like a 20-minute video. 21 minutes. Fuck. All right. We're going to close it here, then. I'll just go ahead and get to the next one, then. Uh, pretty good chapter. Uh, I'm interested to see what happens when they kind of lock in, like Himori and Kurama. Maybe this gives uh, a chance to kind of pull Naruto back out, even though he has, he has no... Chinchuriki like status at this point, right? He's just he's just Naruto. So I don't know. We'll see.